You're watching EAC News. Thanks for joining us. Ministry of Information spokesperson Mia Sopwan has shared that as of this Monday, 25 former Voice of Democracy staff have applied for civil state jobs at the Ministry of Civil Service. The deadline to apply for these jobs is today, Tuesday, 28th February, 2023. EAC News reporter Anthony Ellis has more. Spokesperson Ms. Sopons confirmed to EAC News that the deadline to apply for these jobs in this evening and the Ministry of Public Works and Ministry of Information will check all applications before sending them to the Prime Minister for his final word. He said after 5pm today, those who did not submit applications will be deemed to have rejected the job offer. He also said he is not yet able to confirm how many of the former VOD staff who have applied for civil state job as reporters as he is now waiting for the final review. Speaking at the 11th National Clean City Day event on Monday afternoon, Prime Minister Hun said that the Royal Government welcomes all who wish to join and work with the state and asks for those people not to be labelled as traitors because it is a democracy. Every citizen has the right to choose whether side they prefer. The media outlet VOD had its broadcasting licence officially revoked by the Ministry of Information on the morning of 13th of February 2023 after the outlet failed to write a letter of apology to the Royal Government of Cambodia and Lieutenant General Hun Manet, VOD had published an article alleging that Lieutenant General Hun Manet has signed off an aid to Turkey on behalf of the Prime Minister, which would have been an overstep of his authority. This claim was immediately deemed false by the Prime Minister and the Royal Government. Following VOD's shutdown, Prime Minister Hun Sen offered civil state employment to formal staff, saying that he understands it is not the employees who are at fault, but they are now affected by the mistakes made by the outlet's editorial team. He added there is no issue if the staff do not want to wish work for the state. Anthony Ellis, EAC News.